Hi, this is Rob. Thanks for joining me. We are going to learn how to embed an indicator in NinjaTrader today. I'm going to use the smart breakpoints from Indicator Smart in order to do this. The cool thing about the smart breakpoints indicator is it can tell you where divergences are occurring. It also has outputs to feed into Bloodhound. And so it's a very powerful programming tool in Bloodhound, and it's designed in such a way it can save you a lot of programming and give you the capability of identifying divergences easily. Okay, so uh, I right click my chart and I say indicator, and I go down to smart breakpoints, smart breakpoints right here, and I add it new to my chart. Okay, add it new to my chart. All right. The trick is with the input series. So you just click that and click the little dots there. And this is how you embed. It will default to the chart itself. But one of the cool things about NinjaTrader is you can embed indicators inside of indicators. This gives you a lot of flexibility and a lot of capability for trying out things that might not otherwise be available in other trading programs. NinjaTrader is very flexible in that way. So uh, waiting for that to come up, I will select indicators here. Okay, and I will go down to Smart Momentum. So I want to do the uh, Smart Momentum first, okay? Now uh, you go into the parameters and make sure the parameters are set to match whatever you have for this uh, Smart Momentum. On this particular chart, I have 8 and 24 set on there, okay? And everything else is the same. And so I will apply that to the chart. I put that in panel 5, which isn't what I really wanted to do. And so I'm going to have to move that back up. Let's say indicators again. And I'm going to go to smart breakpoints and I'm going to move that to panel 3 where the smart momentum is. Okay. You'll also want to make sure that your scale justification is right and that your smart momentum scale justification is also right. Okay, You can go to the smart momentum and make sure it is also set to right. If one of those is set as overlay, the two won't line up. So it's important for you to have those line up. When the smart momentum goes through a prior line, as is the case right here, it will send that as a signal to Bloodhound if you are programming in uh, Bloodhound from Shark Indicators. If it goes through two of them, it'll also tell you that. If it goes through three of them, it'll also tell you that. Okay. And I have this set back to look 20 bars. If you wanted it to look back a little bit further, then you just uh, increase that length. All right. So let's also do it with a Smart Trap Trader Oscillator. I'm going to go to Smart Breakpoints again. I'm going to uh, add that new to my chart. I'm going to embed that into the Smart Trap Trader Oscillator, also from Indicator Smart. All these tools on this uh, chart are from Indicator Smart and are part of the Smart Patterns trading system. Okay. And so I'm looking for the Smart uh, Trap Trader Oscillator, which is right here. All right. And I just say OK. And then I put that in panel two. All right, it's right justified. The cool thing about smart breakpoints is it can uh, apply, because of the way this was designed, you can apply that to virtually any indicator. And so this completes our tutorial on how to embed an indicator into another indicator. And in this case, the smart breakpoints having smart trap trader oscillator embedded into it or the smart momentum uh, embedded into it for use in Bloodhound and for use in identifying divergent patterns and other uh, trading patterns that can help you to be successful in your trading. Okay. If you have any questions, come visit us at the oiltradingroom.com and or at indicatorsmart.com. Thank you.